This is how you get better aim in Valorant. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to get better aim in Valorant. But before we begin, don't forget to subscribe to the channel. I have a goal of reaching 20,000 subscribers, so help me reach that goal and subscribe. Okay, let's begin. So everything that I'm going to show you will be done inside of Valorant. You won't need extra applications or softwares, anything like that. Everything will literally be done in Valorant. So go ahead and delete your aim labs, delete your OSU. You might as well delete Fortnite while you're at it. Then head on into Valorant. First thing you're going to want to do is warm up. I recommend warming up with a few death matches death matching will help you wake up if you just woke up and it can loosen you up get that blood flowing you know i recommend playing without sound first just so you can work on your reaction time and then play with sound i normally play death matching with loud music on next go into the shooting range this is where you warm up some more and this will also help with your reaction time valorant has a cool thing with the shooting range you can test literally anything you can test your sensitivity without needing to go into settings it's literally right there all right to start off hit the practice button and kill around 100 bots make sure the bots have full armor and all that stuff so you can only headshot them and just do this all right trust me nba players when they practice shooting they take about 1000 shots a day so 100 bots is nothing and this is where you can work on your one tapping and bullet spray you can also practice doing the elimination streak hit f3 then under streak hit eliminate 100 bot armor on infinite ammo on then click done buy the gun you want click the start button and 100 bots will appear one at a time, so it's a great way to work on your reaction time. It looks something like this. I'll show you another cool way to work on your spray. So head on outside from the shooting range. You'll see these flying drones right here. Try to kill all of them by just holding down the shoot button. So don't let go of the shoot button. And this is a good way to work on your spray transfer as well. So after you kill 100 bots, the next thing you're going to want to do is the shooting range hard mode. Try to get a score of 20 or more on hard mode. Go for 20 using just the sheriff then switch to the phantom then switch to the vandal. If you're struggling to get 20, go for like 15 and just work your way from there and do this every single day. And if 20 is too easy for you try to get like 27 and above my highest is actually 27 using the vandal and this literally is one of the best ways to work on your reaction time this also helps with crosshair placement since the only way to kill a bot is with a headshot so you'll always have your crosshair around the headshot level here's also another cool way to work on your aim so you buy a shorty go to a wall shoot the wall and shoot at the bullet holes from the shorty shot you don't really have to shoot just move your mouse cursor to the, the bullet holes and when you're doing these aiming exercises remember to do them while staying still so only move your mouse then do them while moving for example you would move front and back shoot then move side to side shoot and keep doing this until you get it perfectly anyways that's it for the video guys i hope you guys liked it hit that like button if you did and let me know in the comments if this video helped you remember to subscribe to the channel help me reach 20,000 subscribers we're almost there boys we're almost there anyways i'm out peace